tip Cymraeg Rwythnos, Welsh language tip of the week. And this week we're going to be looking at arddodiaid, prepositions, arddodiaid. Now an arddodiaid or a preposition are groups of words which are used before a noun, a pronoun, and they show direction, time, place, location. So they're very important for us to create our sentences in Cymraeg and in Saesneg. And just like the Saesneg, just like the English, there are many prepositions in Cymraeg. On Tethu, but today we're just going to be looking at the main ones. Ar. Ar, meaning on. Mae hi'n gweithio ar ddydd gwener. Mae hi'n gweithio ar ddydd gwener. She works on a Friday. Am. Am has double meaning, meaning at and about. Mae'r cyfarfod am dri o'r gloch. Mae'r cyfarfod am dri o'r gloch. The meeting is at three o'clock. E. E, meaning two or four. Mi aethon ni i weld y claf. Mi aethon ni i weld y claf. We went to see the patient. Mi aethon ni i weld y claf. Dros, meaning over. Dros. Dros y penwythnos, mi fydd o'n ymlacio. Dros y penwythnos, mi fydd o'n ymlacio. Over the weekend, he will be relaxing. O. O. Again, has double meaning, meaning from and of. Dwi'n byw yn llanelwi, ond dwi'n dod o harlech. Dwi'n byw yn llanelwi, ond dwi'n dod o harlech. I live in St Asif, but I come from harlech. You might hear in the north as well people saying duad o, which means come from. So dod o and duad o, both meaning the same, to come from. At. At. Again, meaning to and towards. Dwi'n mynd at y deintydd bob mis. Dwi'n mynd at y deintydd bob mis. You might have noticed that some of the words that follow the prepositions ar, am, i, dros, o, and at, they cause a soft mutation, a treglad medal. So let's have a look at the first one. Mae hi'n gweithio ar ddydd gwener. Now, Friday in Welsh is dydd gwener, with a D, a singular D. But the R has caused a treglad medal, a soft mutation. So you can see here, the D has doubled to a double D. R ddydd gwener. The mutation helps the sentence to flow. Here again, it should be tri o'r gloch, T-R-I for the number three, tri. But the am has caused a soft mutation. So the T for tree has mutated to a D, a DRI. All prepositions cause a triglad medal, a soft mutations. So it's worth learning the soft mutation pattern. So make a note of the soft mutation table here. If you'd like to add a luggy to revise, if you'd like to revise your Ardodjad prepositions, why don't you use the Quizlet link below to help you add the luggy to revise? It's a really good revision tool to revise key Welsh phrases or vocabulary. I've also found this uh, worksheet from Parallel.com. Again, I recommend that maybe you print this off and it just tells you which preposition follows the verb. So it's got the Cymraeg there and then the Saesneg, the English. Defnyddiwch eich Cymraeg. Use your Welsh. Remember, a little bit of Welsh does go a long way to ensuring that we're providing a bilingual service to our patients and service users. If you'd like any support in Dysgu Cymraeg in learning Welsh, please drop me an email below. Diolch, hofawr.